Evening fellow coin collectors, Coin Snatcher here with a quick update on the 50p collection. So after the big old purchase last week of the 2009 Blue Peter coin, it's been pretty quiet the last week. However, we did have a little purchase that arrived today. So in front of me you'll see we have the uh, Pub Joy Mint Sea Creature set. And this is from the British Indian Ocean Territory. They're 2021 coins. This is a little folder that opens out and there's six different types of coin to collect or six different types of design to collect, sorry. So uh, it started off with the Chagos Anamone, the Powder Blue Tang, the Emperor Angelfish and the Checkerboard Rass. And we've got those four coins in their little holders. And these are brilliant uncirculated coins with a mintage of 2,750 each. So the coin we're looking at today is called the Yellow Long Nose Butterfly Fish. That's a bit of a mouthful. And it arrives in the standard Pop Joy uh, Blue Velvet money bag. So if we just open this up, we can pop the coin out. And it does come in a little capsule already. And um, we'll have a look at it and let's just turn it around the right way so these are really really nice coins if anybody hasn't seen them yet <clears throat> pop in the uh, pop joy mint website and have a look at them the the colors are really really nice you can see the the yellow gold on the body of the fish you've got the black upper head and the white uh, lower head and the the very small fin and then the strange looking dorsal fin at the top and you've got some weeds uh, just where it's swimming through. So the long nosed butterfly fish, uh, 50 pence, legal tender coin, if you happen to ever pop off to the British Indian Ocean Territories, there may be a shopkeeper over there that will happily take this off your hand. And this coin uh, has the Pop Joy Mint effigy of Her Majesty the Queen. And you'll see just in the neckline, there's a PM which is for Pop Joy Mint. So a really nice coin, number five in the series out of six, and we'll pop him in there. So I'll just pop him down properly, and that's him in place. So the other release that goes with this coin is the silver proof version. Uh, the silver proof versions are considerably rarer. They come in a well, you get a little white cardboard box, and then inside you have a, a shiny red leatherette box. And then if we pop this open, there's a little certificate of authenticity and gives you the normal information. I won't read it all out, but the important bit is proof sterling silver 175. So really, really low mintage for a silver proof coin, but uh, they don't seem to have been that popular so far. There's still plenty of them for sale on the website and you don't really see them on the second hand market. So the only sort of issue is that the silver proof and the bunk are very, very similar looking. On some of them, there's a slight variation in color. This one, it doesn't look as if there's any difference in the color. And on the back of it, the frosting on the proof coin is more pronounced. On the bunk coin, it does look frosted, even though it is a, a brilliant uncirculated strike. So really nice uh, coin there. You can see the Queen's head looking really nice and a really nice design of the long nose butterfly fish as well. So this is number five out of six and this will pop over and I'll pop that under the shelf beside the other four that are there already. So we're up to five, only one to go. It's nearly another collection complete, which is happy days. So uh, keep tuned, there'll be more videos on the way. I'm waiting on another coin to come and I'll be doing a video on that. Uh, give you a little hint, it'll be something to do with this old boat here. So if you like the video, uh, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment and peace and love, Coin Snatcher out.